This is an effort to uncover the worst and most incredible criminal organization and, and conspiracy in human history. And they have put this conspiracy together over hundreds of years, centuries it's taken them to get this kind of control. They designed these kinds of, of, of warfares that, that we, we experienced in the last century as a means to this control. And they are willing to do anything to meet their goals. The local group that's running the world. And make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, they are a very dangerous group of people. They are evil beyond anything you can wrap your brain around. I, I've told you this before, they have murdered millions, hundreds of millions. Don't let them succeed, please really the fight for the future of humanity, and that's how important it is. How did they build the Rothschilds into such a powerful force financially and politically, and were they able to buy the Bank of England, and buy the uh, European Central Bank, and the Federal Reserve, and how they've, uh, they've positioned themselves to control world money supplies to the detriment of every single breathing, living creature on the planet except themselves. They have a messiah picked out, and they're waiting to announce it. This stuff is real. The money they've spent is in the trillions. The, much of it has come from the public purse of the United States and Europe. They are working day and night to bring on uh, this mess that's coming, and it is the introduction of a new messiah. Their, their messiah is going to be a figurehead that is housed in, the, uh, in Jerusalem, and they are going to try to set up their one world government through this. In fact, their documents stating these facts have gone back generations. do we need to stand for before we stand up and say that is enough when is enough enough when is it enough for you to say I've had it now we're going to tell everybody we're going to scream it from the rooftops we're going to ignore these morons who want rapture I love this world I love living I love the people that I've met in my lifetime and in my travels and I, I want us to be what kind of world could we have without these people controlling it what kind of world this is the thing we all need to ask ourselves. What kind of world could we have without these people? Well, now we have to envision it and we have to execute this plan to get them out of our lives forever. That's what we must do, and we must do it now. No time to waste here. This is urgent. These files have to be passed around, and this truth has to be shown where the power that it really has.